It's the 25th of July 2019. Anyone guess where I am? I'm in the countryside. I'm going to do a circular walk. I've parked my camper van, Alberta, around the corner there. This is a East Quantock Head and a manor house behind it, which can be seen from the hills clearly. And I'm heading up there to a, some trees, which, which will offer me shelter. I've got to be exposed for a bit while I go um, through a couple of fields to get up there. I don't know where the other fields, where it links up, up that way. I just hope the cows stay where they are. There's none in here. I never came here last time because it did have cows. So I'm going to cross to a stile there. And then there's another one. I've, I don't know if there's cows in the other field. I'm just going to play it by ear at the moment. So it's about going on for midday. And uh, I've had to put a very light t-shirt on. It's a, this is supposed to be a record-breaking day in some parts of the country. Um, not necessarily in Somerset. It was 29 degrees when I went out the other day. So, Or it, it was 27. It's 20, supposed to be 29 today. It's 11.45. So I'm going on a good six-hour walk circular walk it might be longer I don't know I'm doing it reverse last time I went I went from Kilv and walked all the way round okay this time I'm going from East Quantock Head across that field there so I'll come back on when I get further up maybe up closer I've got to cross a dangerous road that Minehead Road the A39 I've got to cross that and then hopefully the cows are too weary to do any chasing. Over and out. Right, my heart is really racing, right? You never guess. I've had to come through, not even to the gate yet. There's some cows sheltering under there, right? Thank goodness. It's hot and they're not lively. Right, they're under there. They did stare at me when I came through a gate down there, right? I came through a gate down there about 20 minutes ago anyway while I was getting through the gate I put my camera on that beam that cross beam now and unbeknown to me I left it there and I walked all round the edge keeping an eye on the cows climbing up a hill in the hottest day of the year in midday I got here to take a picture of this scene and what did I discover no camera I knew I had it when I crossed the main road there and took pictures of the cottage. Then I thought, yeah, you stopped to have a drink of water. You put the camera down. So I got here. In fact, I was up under that tree for shelter after walking across this hot field. I had to go back. The cows are watching me. I thought, I ain't going back that way now. I've got to come back across here. So like this is where I am. On a baking hot day, I not only got up this field, which is on a hill, but I had to go back to get the camera. Fortunately, the cows. Because when I first came in, there was a black cow with horns, and it did stare at me. I haven't seen it since. It sort of disappeared. Now, when I did this walk last time, I did it the other way around. I came down, and there were no cows that I could see. But there's more than just them there. There's a huge herd in there. There's another herd up there. And I have been up. I came up, back, and up. Imagine the energy that's used, and that's like a pint of water. I left the camera. If I actually got a through the gate and then taking another picture before I went up the hill I would have realised this is what can happen it's a hot day but what my fear is the, was those cows you only got to get one frisky one I've been chased I know exactly what they do I've been chased I know what it's like and these cows come all over here there's the gate, folks, over and out.